Sandra Ping. Today, in the celebration of the National Bible Day, we gather to reaffirm our faith and rejoice in the Word of God. Please allow me to share. Nung nabubuhay pa ang aking ina, ang ex, an extraordinary woman of faith who had always loved God and taught us, her children, to do the same, dedicating her life to pass her pious ways to us. Palagi niyang pinapaalala sa amin na ang Biblia ang pinagmumulan ng pag-asa, patnubay, at lakas. Among the many verses that stand close to my heart is the passage in the book of John, chapter 10, verse 10, where Jesus said, The thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. These words speak of our greatest challenge as a nation, the deeply entrenched thievery that steals and kills and destroys. A sin contrary to the law of God, so does the act of anyone who joins the thief by keeping a blind eye on his selfish act. It begs the question, ano ang pagkakaiba ng na magnanakaw sa kalsada at ng magnanakaw sa gobyerno? Ang magnanakaw sa kalsada pumipili ng ninanakawan at nanakawin. Biktimang walang laban upang agawin ang kanyang gamit, alahas man o salaping pinaghirapan o anumang mahalagang ari-arian. Samantala, ang magnanakaw sa gobyerno, mamamayang Pilipino ang pumipili tuwing sasapit ang halalan. Tayo pa nga ang nagsishade ng kanyang pangalan sa balota at hindi siya namimili ng nanakawin. Wala siyang pakialam kung ang kanyang ninanakaw ay ang ating mga karapatan sa edukasyon, hanap buhay, kalusugan at maayos at masaganang pamumuhay at higit sa lahat ang kinabukasan ng kabataan. For the longest time, we have witnessed how corruption, the most, the worst form of thievery, continues to destroy our nation, and we only have ourselves to blame. I hope and pray that this day, the National Bible Day, shall serve as a reminder. Just for one day on Election Day, let us not allow ourselves to be partners of the thieves. Let us stand mightily against the, the evils of, of their actions. Let us continue to feed our spirit with the wisdom of God's words and express our gratitude for the light of Christ that guides our path against the wicked and towards the good. Thank you and have a meaningful National Bible Day. Maraming salamat, Senator Ping Lakson.